The second quarter, and Lakeshore got the ball out, right? I, I said Texas ball, it was Lakeshore ball. No, Lakeshore has a chance to go ahead. There they go. There goes Joel Wilmoth. Mark Supan cannot keep up with Joel. Look at that. Joel has Mark on, on, the, on the speed. Mark is not slow. No, Whatever you say, Mark, Mark is, is not, not slow. slow. There goes Shimakawa. Speed on just about everybody, except Look. maybe Shin. Shimakawa under being pushed there. That's where it finds uh, Mark. Mark knew you need to come help him out. So, uh, and there he is. Nice the score. Tie game again. 14-14. Look, look at Joel getting free down there. They'll try to front him. Oh, that, that was... They get on top, but they got and Brian. There's the Brian. Brian easily picks it up and scores. And well, now back. it's 15-14, Lakeshore. See, Lakeshore now with the lead, and, uh, you know, that's a, that's a three-point swing. They were up by they were up by two, and now they're down by one. So that uh, shows you how quickly this game can change. Well, actually... They didn't have possession, so I, I'd say it was a two-point swing. Okay. But. They need to capitalize. They need to capitalize. There you go. Shimakawa coming, yeah. looking for Mark. Mark's got his back to him. Mark looking, knows he's around. There he goes. They try to keep keep the ball handler when he's stuck like that. Oh, there goes Shimakawa. Not letting him finish up. Right. Crook and couldn't, couldn't close that. And when Shimakawa gets going, he's fast. He's very slow. Oh, look at this. Nicely done. They had two people. They were, the, you know, Mark's giving uh, Brian Fitz, and, and Shimmy would stay with him, man to man, hoping for them to make a mistake. And that would look at that pass. Being able to make that pass like that. It was right on the money. The equipment problem here. Mark Supan with some equipment issues here. Out goes the big dog and <laughs> straighten him out. That's it, he lifts him up and he feels better already. A well, little bit of that big love. Got Bob and Brian working on Shin to try and keep him high. Deny the pass. Look how many people converging on Mark. Mark got down and under and he's by now. Oh, look at that. Eddie Crouch with her hands almost took him, oh, skipped it. Brian stripped him and then. Oh, is that it? Shimmy there waiting on the other side. That was close. Well, Brian tied back up. Real discipline game. Get it to be, he would have been in the, the send in, as some people call it, uh, several times. By oh, look at this. Bob Lujano. You know what, I, I think Shimmy should have gone for that one. He might have been able to disrupt him on that. I, I think that was a mistake. You know, that was a mistake. You think he gave up on it too? Yeah, I think he gave up on it. I think he might have been able to, to give a hit there to Bob. It might have taken him over, or at least maybe disrupted the, the, the uh, change of position, you know, the ball. He pulled back. I thought he was going to go ahead and take the left side of Scott. Yeah. Look at that, Scott. He finds an open. Scott took out Kirkland with that pick, and that was that. We've got an interesting matchup going on. Uh, Joel and Shin are going to go. Oh, oh, that was an almost a turnover there. Almost a turnover. Time is getting down, and there goes Joel. Oh, big hit. Not over with two seconds. Just big hit, big hit. Look at all the pressure. Look at all that pressure. Now they're not calling a trap because he does have room to move back. Otherwise, they would have started the trap. Oh, uh, you know what? Norm had his hands on that ball, and if you called, uh, sometimes you could call that as to having, uh, a, you know, depending on who the ref is, they would have called that as. Uh, but, but Norm's a one, and Brian's a two, and they, they usually won't give a, a, a possession or a jump to, to a low pointer reaching them on a higher point. So what, so what you're telling me there is that there's a little bit of a... Uh, uh, well, it, it's, it's, no, it's, it's not a, a bias. It, it's called control. You know, like, 
if uh, if I've got the ball as a half. Chin on the towel, beautiful. Yep, chin on it. The way he moves, he's so slick. Like you say, he's like a shark. All right, so you're saying uh, But if, say, I get the ball, uh, or, uh, or Eddie gets the ball as a half in his lap. Uh, you really can't do much of much it. Penalty goal. All right, penalty goal. It was a breakaway already, so. Yeah. Foul. But when a high pointer reaches in there, he legitimately probably does have control, so it's called a jump. Yeah. Whereas the other way around, if I'm a low pointer, I reach in there, even if I got my hand on the ball, I don't have control because they can just take it away. So it's true. It, it's, it's really it's true. more what it is. It's frustrating. Well, you know, you low pointers take this kind of crap but for long and uh, accept this. That's all right, you know. Don't stick up for yourselves. Well, <laughs> we, we need to learn where we can play the game. We yeah. can play it where we can do it. I know. I know. Just... If we try to be high players, we all want to have the ball in store. You know what you're seeing there, which uh, Texas, which Denver didn't do, uh, is that they're doing a good job picking and keeping the, the lane open. Uh, well, you'll see them just going down the line. It's like running a picket. You know, one pick down or another, on down, just forming that fence. Look at that pass. Bob Lahano with a beautiful, just a toss over to Joe. There were three touches on that. You know. That's it. Very, you know, and they don't want Eddie to touch it, so. They don't, but um, I, I, we've seen. I've seen a game where he scored more than anyone, where he kept getting open, and he kept throwing it down the length of the court, and he kept picking it up. He was I, playing the deep man. He was playing the deep man. I thought, okay, now I've seen it all. Look at that. Nice move by Mark. Yeah. And, oh, look at that. Mark was finding a See hole. How quickly Joel came back though. Yeah. Well, yeah. Well, Scott missed that pick. We have a equipment timeout, looks like. Well, Mark might be a little bit upset with that. Thank yeah. You. Play should have continued. Yeah, ex so it wasn't exactly. I believe uh, I saw him over there by the uh, Eagle, uh, Eagle uh, wheelchair maintenance station that we got here. They Eagle comes in here, and every year Marty sets up his, his uh, his chair maintenance station, and they provide wheels and repairs and, uh, and things like that on the spot. Uh, provide equipment, really a big service to the tournament. You can't run a tournament without having you need wheels. Some sort of a, uh, a, an equipment and repair uh, station. And they, they're here year after year after year supporting the USQRA and this great support. And nobody yes. does. Now let's okay. Let's see if uh, there it is. The score. It would have been a shame if they didn't score after they had basically uh, had basically scored and uh, on had a, the score taken them away. Yeah, because the, the equipment shouldn't have made a difference on that one. Joel's it got sometimes, and it, and it was too bad. That, that was it. Joel has such good hands too. You know, considering he has. No has, hands. Has essentially no hands. Right. All right, we're uh, Lakeshore is up by one, uh, but Texas is staying right with them. They were ahead by two, and now they're uh, down by one. But uh, this game is, is you can see why these two teams are playing and have played so well. Look at that. Oh, look at this. There's, there's the seagull. Oh, look at that. I have to give it. When when a, when a low pointer like Norm pulls the ball down with with an oncoming freight train and Ryan Kirkland, and, and that shows you a little bit of uh, what what you need to happen. That was a chance they took there. He, he slipped right on over the goal. Without getting hit. We'll see what Mark does with. We got Joel three minutes Mark. left. Oh, look at that! Two of them on him. Two of them on it. They're, and he's got his back. He's got his back to everybody. Trying to turn around, find Brian Kirkland, he did. Three on three. Oh, back to Bob. And. That's a shot clock, it's 10 seconds. We're down to five seconds on the shot clock. Joe is having a voice. Oh, they gave him, a knocked, he knocked Shimmy over the line. Yep. And that was a, uh, a penalty a goal. Hit. Gives you a penalty goal, a big hit. And they're ahead by one. If he that couldn't was... have knocked him over, I don't think he would have scored. Here we go, here's your race. But no, Joel, 
Joel knew he wasn't going to catch up with him. He had that extra push on him. Once he had that extra push, there wasn't going to way he could get that speed up fast enough. When he gets into that third push, he's, he's just about up to top end. Yeah. Although I don't know that Shin does go, accelerate the whole way right here. Down the yeah. Well, you know what? Uh, I was impressed by the Portland speed of Portland. Uh, they had some great speed out there. With almost everybody in that team's fast, except for their low low pointer. That was a nice pass. Yeah. yeah. And Max actually is fast for, for a one. Yeah. But uh, he's he's a, he's. But a Seth, player. but Seth and Grau and uh, Will Grau and uh, and uh, Ian Chan. I mean, they're they're a, they're a balanced team, and uh, they're they're going to be a match for Hoveron. And we'll see what uh, what happens there. There. So some coaches have just come right out and say that you know, nice pass. that's the fastest group in the league right now. Yeah. Those three. And this is the hardest hitting in Lakeshore in the league. I believe so. So um, there's a lot of speed on both sides though. And, and in any of these games. And Texas, what do you have to say about Texas? Whoa, boy, that was close. And there's a score, but nicely done. I you there have been very few turnovers in this game, which is a key. And the other part of what it is, is that both sides have been scoring pretty well. Oh! oh and that is that a spin. I, that was a spin. That was a spin, yeah. Well, that's a big hit. And I think we want to write that one down, so uh we need to put that on the instant replay list. Yeah, one one point three nine left in the in the half. He's a big man. I believe he's six yeah. to six seven. Yeah, he, when he when he goes over, it's like a tree in the in the forest, you know. And they're not going to do much about that. But you notice that Mark didn't complain about that one. <laughs> no, he didn't. He, he was complaining a lot in his earlier game. All right, they they put Mark. Well, look at that. They got Mark in there throwing them all in. Well, he needed to get out of the box. Get yeah. Down in the Look at this. Right now. Right now we got time. Nice, nice block by Scott. And there's a the score. That was, you know what? They have really regained their composure. And they're playing a lot better against this team than they played against Portland. They really are. They really have played. Uh, uh, you've seen all these guys, um, the, the, the picks that Scott and Norm have been setting have been really crucial for opening up the thing and then uh, the working together of uh, Simakawa and even he's been doing the picks. Mark. Mark has been able to do what he needs to do. They're playing a good game and you're right, they have stepped it up. This is a must win game for them, obviously, you know, to get yeah. into the championship. And uh, I don't think anybody expected to win that game. Right? Well, Mark, they did. No. All right, here we go. Pass down court and uh, Shimmy coming and not much he can do. So now we got a back pick here. We're gonna yeah, look at this. They got Mark. Okay, he calls in bounders. They just forced. Well, they're not gonna give it to him. No, but he's uh, he's freed himself up. You no, know, it was probably better that they did it this way. Oh, well, look at that pass. Nice pass. One thing that uh, doesn't get mentioned a lot about Shin, and uh, that is that he's got one of the most accurate passes. We have 50 seconds left. We're looking at a couple possessions here, and we're looking to see what. 25. Texas would love to force a turnover here. Look at Brian, at, and that's uh, it. At 13 seconds. They want to hold it down. They've got 22 seconds left on the clock. They want to run it down and leave only about seven seconds if they can, or 10 seconds left. The oh, they left a lot of time left on it. They left 24. 24 seconds left. I think he should have held on to that for a little while. There was no reason to rush over the line. This gives them enough time for them to answer it and tie the game at the end of the half, if they can do it. They can. This is plenty of time to score. All right, let's see what happens. Here goes Mark. Could be there. We're going for two. There he goes. He's across the time. Down to 13. 
We'll see if they, you know, they're going to go in and now yeah, he's going to hold it. He's going to hold it, hold it. So, Reaching in right. with six seconds left. And this will be it. No, I don't know that they're, they're going to cry. Right they got Joel, long pass. Mark bump, Mark bump. There goes the long pass, long bump. Oh, and not too time often is going to be down to two bump. seconds. I don't think so. And that is it. And at the end of the first half, we have a great game here, aren't you say? 26-26, you're seeing Texas Lakeshore, and this is going to be a great second half. Stay tuned. Wait a minute. They're Bob resetting the clock. They're going to put some time back on the clock. Oh, we're putting some time back on the clock. Okay, how much time are we putting back on here? We'll see. Uh, we're putting five minutes. <laughs> no, <I'm> just <laughs> a little bit of humor there, sorry. Uh, well, I think we're in the seconds here. One second? No, I, uh, they're going to wind it down. This clock has been a little bit of a challenge for them. Uh, and that's it. It's over with. And that's it. We're the end of the first half. You're on xable.com. Bob Crandall giving color. Rob Rowan. And we'll be back.